Hey guys, Todd Holcomb here demonstrating the software side of my Ultimate Intellivision Flashback project. Now this is a project where I take a Raspberry Pi and Ultimate PC interface and cram it into the shell of an Intellivision Flashback. I've got the excellent JZINTV emulator up and running on the Pi with Emulation Station. It takes about 40 seconds to boot up, but once you're there, you don't have to restart. Now what's cool is you can control everything from the Intellivision controller including pause, reset, exit to the emulator, and menu navigation. So you can scroll through the games with the controller and view box art and a short description of each game. You can also use the keypad to scroll up and down 10 games at a time. All right, let's fire up one of my favorites. Now I've gotten rid of as much of the operating system text as I could, but there's still a little bit between games. One of the biggest complaints of the Intellivision flashback is its poor sound emulation. Well, I'm happy to say the buzz is back. Ah, music to my ears. Okay, so we'll get, see if I can show you my controller here. Okay, so from the controller, we can do a live pause with four and clear, and then you can get it going again. You can still do the traditional pause with the one and nine. You can do five and eight, which resets the game. And then if you hold six and enter, it brings it back to the front end. So the advantages I see of this project are beautiful full screen HDMI output. You can play all in television games. You have the ability to pause, reset, and exit the game all from the controller. And you've got better sound emulation. So that's about it guys. You can check out the hardware side of things on Atari Age in the Intellivision forums. I'm off to play some more games. See ya!